Hi Espers Advance, Merry Christmas na agad sa inyo. We will proceed to our fourth game review this month, Tavernacle. Another tower defense game that you can play co-op or mag-isa lang. And I do have to mention that the G-Round version is different with the Steam version. As yung gagamitin natin ngayon na demo doesn't support co-op. If you want to test that game mode out, let me know para masamahan ko kayo sa Steam version nito. We are going to play as a group of dwarves, so let's start. Here are our current settings. Sa visual settings natin, wala naman tayong binago from the default. Nakakausi lang talaga yung letter D sa my distance since it's not capitalized in comparison with the other words. Audio settings, ang binabaan lang natin is yung music volume. And as for the gameplay settings, wala na tayong binago dito. When we click on play, sasalubungin tayo ng ganitong interface wherein you can play with three other more players. Pero ngayon, we are running solo, so... Let's click on spacebar. We have Storvald, Lognar, Fagraster, Skaldrick, and a random option. So walang babae dito. Let's go for Lognar. And ready to play. Spacebar natin yan. We are going to play the second stage ng Waspocalypse Espers. Dito tayo sa may scrambled eggs. Let's go. Similar with Overcooked Espers, pwede kayo magbato ng mga resources dito to make a more chaotic gameplay along with your peers. Let's hold on spacebar. Maybe you should go back. Pano mag proceed? Oh, wala option to proceed with a mouse click. You only have a skip cutscene when you hold it. Oh, it's time to defend our tavern. And as a start, Espers, nilaro ko na nga pala yung first level na to. We are going to gather resources first to try and build our towers. So we only have two available areas wherein you can... Medyo, wait lang, medyo disturbing yung sound na naririnig ko. What are those? Huh. I will actually try to restart the game, Espers, since meron parang maingay na bubble sound. Let's see if mare-resolve yan. And it did persist. We can press E to show the strategic view. And... When we do our mouse hover, pwede natin makita kung saan naman gagaling or yung path ng kalaban. I'm guessing na ito yung maingay, yung zeppelin, which I really don't understand kung para saan or paano gawin itong mga to. Mukhang pwede tayo makapag-provide ng resources to our two towers without going near it, pero hindi ko sure paano yung interaction dito. We're actually going to construct two flamethrowers. And grab natin yan. Ooh, you can actually go and press spacebar, no? Parang atake niya yata yun. Another one right here. So we need four wood, two bricks. And medyo awkward yung camera angle right now. Let's chop this one. And we are actually making noise. Pag napuno natin yan, Espers the Wasp will actually respond. Time to bring our resources here. Pwede nga pala siya iba to tulad nung in-instruct kanina. We do it by holding the right mouse button and then letting go. Walang ginagawang noise ang paglalagay ng resources. Dito sa constructs. And we are actually missing one more. Uh, ayaw niyang magbago ng view. Alright, just enough. One more wood. Tignan natin kung may makukuha tayo dito. Medyo RNG. Pag nanggaling dyan. So let's just opt for this one. And... Alright, medyo bitin mo. So we are going to hold off on that. Dito muna tayo sa may second natin na... Tower. I'm not sure where the cooldown of our dashes are. Then hold again. Release. Sirain naman natin yung malapit dito. Although, sirain natin siya away from this water since I believe pwede tayong malunod. And our dwarves do not know how to swim. So let's steer that away from there. Grab it. Grab it. And we don't need additional bricks there. Grab another wood. Nakukulang pa tayo ng isa. Hopefully meron to espers. Let's pray for the best. Merong isa. Saktong sakto. We're actually just going to prepare other materials before we start or fully construct our towers. 7, 8, And ayun, we made too much noise. Let's proceed. Sana umabot tayo dito. Malayo-layo pa naman yata yung mga kalaban sa ating bridge. Our goal next would be to try and upgrade this one. Two wood. Okay. Okay na yan. More wood to upgrade the shield. Hindi natin yan tatapon. 
Do we need bricks? We need two. Okay, more wood. And dito yan. We need four. I mean, three of those. Pa. Gamitin natin to. To construct metal. This one, throw it here. You can actually queue items or yung pagka-craft. Mukhang may iiwan yung isa natin. Okay lang. Meron pa naman tayo isang tower sa likod. And you can see the bubbles, espers. Those are our resources para mas madaling makita. Hopefully, hindi pa nababawasan yung tavern natin. Wala pa nakaabot doon. Sana. Ano ko pwede itong atakihin eh? Uy! Joke lang. That didn't work. And mukhang our dash is just for gap closers. Wala na ibang use yun from the looks of it. Wala tayong pakisagin noise na ginagawa natin since the enemies are already here. Eh, mali. Dito pala dapat. And one more brick. We can actually upgrade this. Pero when you upgrade espers, hindi mo pwedeng galawin or hindi makakagalaw yung tower na yun. So, sort of disadvantage dun. Wala na ako makita. More wood. Okay, lagay lang natin yan dito. What upgrade this to the third level? Lalapitan na natin since we need to upgrade it. We are going to build it with our hammer. Denoted ng yellow, siguro yung under construction. So let's go here. Pwede pa siyang i-upgrade more. I wonder hanggang ilang level to. Pwede. Hindi na natin kailangan ng wood dyan. Alright. Uy. Get it, boy. Uy. Nakatake tayo ng kalaban, ah. Need more wood. We need five, actually? Oh, no. Kulang. We're any sir on the way. Medyo hectic tayo dito sa may unang tower natin, pero he is actually manhandling things. Buti hindi tayo natatamaan ng kalaban. Uy, uy. Ayun na nga. Narinig tayo ng AI. Uy, huwag mo kang tamaan, sir. Nananahimik ako. Uy! We are stunned. Wait, may nakalagpas na isa sa mga kalabat. Uy! Actually, joke lang. May resist siya. Mukhang din na natin i-upgrade to. Kaya niya kaya. We will see. Oh no! We're going to drown! Laki-laki yung kailangan na resources dito. Kaya niya naman yata. Oh no. They're actually resistant to heat. So mali tayo dun. We didn't try to make variation sa mga tower na ginagawa natin. Doon tayo malulugian. And I'm not sure if we can actually change our towers. Walang ganong option. So ang matitira na lang would be to try and upgrade it. Kahit mali siya. Oh, tinamaan pa rin. Okay, camera angle is a bit wonky. And I actually don't have time to... So far, mukhang wala naman nakakalagpas na kalaban natin. Very good. And we need an easier way to access our Zeppelin because right now, it's not serving us any use. One more. Sakto-sakto yung kinuha natin. And we need to construct that. So, lapitan na natin siya. Hopefully, we get it just in time for our wave of enemies. I'm actually curious what this does. Ano kina craft mo? Huh? What's this for? Let's try and throw it sa ating kalaban. Pero may mga dinadrop siya na al. Oi, sapling. And wow, you are the last remaining enemy. You are cute. And let's see you burn, baby. Burn, baby, burn, 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 burn. All right. Ah, meron siya na sa spawn na para molotov barrel. Sayang, hindi ko na ita yun. Should travel upstream to find where these eggs are coming from. Napaganda nung ginawa natin last hit don. Oh yes, more eggs. Mas masaya tayo pag mas marami ng blog. Tavern damage is two. 
Meron palang nakalagpas, hindi natin na malayan. Most likely since we deployed two of the same towers. We're going back to the menu. Let's see if we can proceed to the next one. Pero I am betting that this requires more players to complete. Let's just try it and see kung ano mangyayari. Traveling upstream. Meron palang ganitong guide. Hindi man lang sinabi. The number of wasps is unusual for these lands. Oof lang yung scenario natin since we cannot skip the cutscene. Different kinds of wasps. My bomber and then yung other one. Nakalimutan ko na tawag sa kanila. Venomous wasps. Tignan <laughs> natin kung ilang pwedeng lagyan ng towers dito. We actually have one, two, three, and four. I am betting kakailanganan natin ng additional person for this one. So, I am going to stop my review right here. I am up for the challenge pero dun pa nga lang sa stage na dalawa yung minamanage natin na towers ngarag na paano pa kaya dito sa apat yung kailangan natin The first and second levels require one player I believe and moving forward mo ang kailangan na ng two or more The Zeppelin sound can be reduced at default kasi disturbing siya right now para may nagbo-blow ng bubbles sa tenga ninyo There are also some weird camera angles that the developers can optimize Medyo mahirap lang siguro i-replicate yun The developers should try to include lady dwarves as well sa character selection or let us players customize our own. Madali lang naman yan in terms of color, hairstyle, kung anong suot, and syempre some other basic facial features. Three towers lang currently ang pwede natin i-deploy. Hindi ko lang alam kung hanggang ilang upgrades ang pwedeng i-apply. You can try this game out as press from the Giron platform. Use my referral link down below and let me know kung hanggang sang stage kinaya nyo ng solo. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And if you've tried this game out, be sure to post a review sa my platform and huwag nyong kakalimutan sumali sa G-Round Hero Season 3. Link is in the description as well. Thank you for your continuous support, Espers, and hopefully you continue to watch my game reviews as we step into another year. Come on, you can do it. Let's go. Let's go, I'm helping, I'm helping. Alright, I'm stalling them. Alright, let's go. We're doing this solo, our tavern's already in flames. Up in flames, come on, you can do it. Ah, la 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 la. Actually stalling it and may reset siya. Don't reach the tavern. Hindi ko makikita ang matalo siya. Did we do it? I think we actually did it. Hindi ko malang nakita since nagsiswimming tayo. I feel quite alright. Hmm? You guys were just there inside the tavern, drinking beer, I think. Let's find somewhere safer to settle down. Alright, I think we finished the third level. Surprisingly, no? And look at the tavern damage. Yun pa rin naka-display sa upper left-hand side. Okay, we did it. Solo espers. Kaya pala. Sadyang malayo lang talaga yung pagkukuha na mo ng resources and just throw it where it's supposed to be your aim. Has to be decent.